Hi, my lovely people. Baby, let this disclaimer run. Let this disclaimer run. Section 107, fair use allows us to talk about it. Don't go out of your way to dislike anybody we talk about in this video. And keep in mind, it is my opinion and my opinion only. Baby, let's talk about these two here. Let's talk about these two here. When I tell you, boy, we got a mother and daughter combo out here that may be beaten, okay? Peach and mother freaking Tracy, it might be beating them because... At this point, these two, they think it's these, but not in a good way, all right? Now, I'm going to say this, okay? We ain't did Nika in a while. I'm not sure why Nika, and if y'all do, can y'all let me know down in the comments below why she changed her channel? Because, you know, she went from uh, Nika's busy life and additional uh, 10 to something about uh, Miss Nika's... Uh, busy real life some crap i mean I, I don't know why she changed channels i mean was there some monetization problems i'm not sure but if y'all do know please let me you know know down in these comments below but baby let's talk about it now see i'm gonna tell y'all something uh when it comes to naya i don't feel sorry for naya yes naya is caught in a vicious cycle of generational curse okay she's caught in that but then there's some people who get caught in it and they just don't like it and when we saw naya out here and she was working and she was doing this and she was doing that we really thought that naya didn't like the generational curse that she was caught in right but we if y'all keep in mind all right ever since naya has not been able to work baby she has turned into her mama full force naya is out here getting her nails done getting her hair done all on her mama's dime naya's out here uh getting cash apps naya's sitting here in the live while her mama begging for cash apps for a happy meal naya is sitting out here knowing all along that the these kids and her mama are going into stores to steal, okay? And she goes along with the chaos and laughs about it. Everything that we once thought has now come to be not what's going on. Naya likes the, the drama. She likes the tragedy. Then... Naya, just like mother, like daughter, Naya is now beginning to post on her channel more and she's starting to do all this talking and oh, what she wants and what she thinks. And then she did responding to, you know, questions. And uh, I really, when she did this q and I'm responding to these comments. She sure kept on saying, people ask me what my cash app is. This person asked me what my cash app was. She kept on saying that because like I said, she's just like her mother she can't help that she's exactly like her mother because her mother created her and she's got everything going on but you got nika going over here making videos saying that she needs naya to get a job she needs naya to pitch in she needs naya to help with bills naya is saying that she wants to move out of town and naya is saying this and naya is saying that all the things that naya is saying we don't see naya doing absolutely any of those things to get done first off y'all sitting here talking about who gonna pay insurance when we all know, and I've seen it on foot on neck chat and on her community. Um, Naya, the accident was labeled pretty much as your fault. You got a ticket for uh speeding, reckless speeding. So therefore, you were out here doing something you had no business doing, and y'all mama tried to cover it up because your arm was broken, like you were the victim. She tried to cover it up like she was the victim, and Oh, my daughter, she's like in, you know, almost in a coma, you know, stuff like that. She just went, all right, and tried to go to the far extent to make everybody forget that the fact of the matter was, guess what? The accident was Naya's fault. Nika, okay, she is one of the lowest of the low of the mommies that we talk about on here. And we all know that. We all see that. But at the end of the day, I'm still shocked that she ain't making that daggone papa get no job. I'm still shocked that Naya, the girl that we thought was just, oh, so, you know, innocent, so sweet. Oh, she down for her brothers. She's down for her sisters. Well, let me see. If Naya was so down for her brothers and her sisters, why does Naya... Make sure she lay her grown self in a bed while the rest of her siblings are coughing and laying on the floor, laying on dirty blankets, laying on pallets, sweating and sick. Now, I know her arm is broken this time, but this is before all the arm was broke. Then if these people were so good and Naya was so good, the fact that she making videos that, 
Oh, my mama going to get my nails done. Oh, we pay $100 to get our hair braided. But girl, you up in there making salmon patties with a daggone broken sink, okay? No hot water. The sink looking like a faucet. Girl, this sink looking like a hose that they about to go put a wildfire out with. Just squirting and spraying every darn where. Your mama sit here boiling water to make dish water and clean pots and pans before she even use them. But you worried about your siblings, right? You worried about your siblings. You weren't worried about your siblings having snacks, food, and everything else while you was out here getting your hair braided. Then just to throw on a stanky bonnet. Now, I'm going to tell y'all something. I know a lot of y'all will probably say, well, this girl is just what her mama made her. But at some point in time, you got to stand up and want better, right? And that's what we thought. But I'm going to tell y'all something that I noticed. Have y'all ever seen Naya go get uh, her hair braided or pay money to get her nails done when she was working with her own money? Have y'all ever seen Naya get on camera and be at bingo all the time with her mama when she was making her own money? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. So I'm going to tell you one thing. It's a lot of selfishness going on in this house. And these two women, the two women, the two oldest women in the house are supposed to be leading the household. Baby, they are two selfish people because they are so worried about themselves. Do we see Naya out here doing any of this when she was working? Absolutely not. That girl was going to work with a daggone bonnet on her head and a piece of wig that probably smelled like, oh, God, that daggone trash compactor that they take that daggone trash to. She was not doing all of this. She was looking rough, being rough, and staying rough. Now that she's not working, she's sure making sure that she looks uh, decent. And when I say decent, baby, I mean decent to their standards because it still ain't decent. But, y'all, I don't know if y'all been keeping up with her. Don't. You know, forget that she did change over channel. So in case y'all wonder where some of this content is coming from, she's got this new channel, uh, Nika's Real Life, keeping it the eye, keeping it real. Heck, I don't know. Just type in Nika. She'll pop up. But yes, I will see y'all in the comments so we can talk about this some more.